Holanda contra China, China contra Holanda. La rival de María saldrá de este combate. Fresh contra Suji. Primer round. So Netherlands versus China. You can see the height advantage that this Chinese athlete has. Must be constantly working and fainting, trying to provoke a reaction. Strong kick off the front leg. Just a quick glance at the scoreboard to see if it had registered. Still 0-0. Zero, zero. Cautious start by the Chinese athlete, but this is the tape pace that she works at more or less all the way through the match. So Reshmi Wiegang has got to find a way inside that leg length. And because she's not what she goes towards, not to walk onto a kick to the body or even the head. Referee wants more activity. Rest me working mainly off the front leg so far. I think she will start to come off the back leg towards the end of the round. Definitely later on in the match. Weight evenly distributed, so she could throw off the back leg. But it's Zeng that tries first to come off the back. There we go. A bit of a grimace there, not sure what happened, but she's definitely okay. Still no point scored as yet. Comes off the back leg, but there's definitely a, a clash there. Referee's not happy, doesn't think it's a an offence as such by the Chinese athlete, so tells Reshmi to continue. Only a few seconds left, so get a minute to recover. She's not happy with that, she's definitely <laughs> limping and grimacing there. But no point scored against her, so the coach is happy with that. 0 0 for Reshmi Wiegink of the Netherlands and Xu Yin Zheng of China. <laughs> So we saw that change in tactics there, which we expected. Wesley's <laughs> coming off the front leg. There's that clash there, not a deliberate act. So second round about to get underway. Where should be starting off the front leg? Zen goes up high. Exchange of movements there. She might be just to have pushed over, but no, it's a stumble, so it's a Congo against the Chinese athlete, Xu Yin Zeng. A little bit of a calm period now. To last minute. <laughs> Reshmi there, it's definitely stepping up, desperate to score a point, throws a punch. <laughs> the longer the match goes on with a zero score, the more it plays into Zeng's favour. With that log length, leg, long leg length. Yeah. 
So no point scored as yet. Closing seconds of the second round. Zeng tried to counter Reshmir, she moved in. So Su Yin Zeng using that leg length to keep her Dutch opponent away from her. Straight from the Chinese coach there, so I say, why haven't you scored? Why haven't you used your advantages here? Attempt for the headshot, hooking back, but there wasn't any clear impact or power to it. Reshmi comes back with a punch, travelling forwards, and that's when the Chinese athlete came over. Good movement by Rieging to get out of the range, the long kicking distance of the Chinese opponent. Last round, I can't see this going to Golden Point. Let's hope it doesn't. Reshmi Wieging of the Netherlands in blue. Xu Yin Zheng from China in red. Strong shot by Zheng off the front leg. He's now starting to look up for the headshots. And Reshmi's got to be careful not to move on to them. You can see the Chinese athlete going up for the headshots. As we say, no, there's no way that got through. So still no points. Lots of activity from the Dutch fighter. She won this event last year, the Grand Prix final in Mexico, in Caratero. And she'll be looking to do that again here in Mexico City. Warning against Zeng, that's the second one. Second warning, she's doubled in the first round, so that puts Wiegink ahead. One minute left. It's a very tight margin. We're going to see Zeng go high. Can Reshmi add to that score or keep it? as it is. It's going to be tough. Over 40 seconds left. Reshmi physically looks the tighter of the two athletes. Needs to be careful with the ring position as well. Zeng going high. Reshmi showing that she's defending. Xu Yin Zeng going to use that leg length now. a bit frustrated that she tries to back here but it wasn't very convincing hooks the body wasn't strong enough we get there's a punch but it's, again it's not clean enough to register thanks going high 12 seconds left can't oh can go against we needs to be careful that doesn't happen again one needs to watch the ring position the chinese girl looks desperate for it she's really frustrated now if that second kyongo it is that levels the score, second Kyongo. They're playing the card for it. The card's been played. It's just Reshmi's urging her brother and coach Michael to play the video review, saying that shouldn't have been a Kyongo. Let's just see what happens here. Video review, Chung video review. It's quite interesting they've changed the video review judges there. As Elva Adams would have been a former Chinese Taipei athlete, so might have been thought to have had some involvement with or relation or view on that match, which has come out as a video review judge to ensure transparency and fairness. So, this could change the match.
Just looking at that review. Now, is it to overturn the referee's decision that a foul was committed? It's rejected, so the points stay as they are. 1-1. One, one. Match for seconds left. And that's it into the golden point. How frustrating for Reshmi Wiegink for the Netherlands. She thought she got it, and then that can go, cost her dearly. So, golden point round. Frustrating for Reshmi Wiegink. She's got to get her head round. She goes to the point early on, before we've started the clock even. So she's showing that she's she's going through now. Just watching this, and actually, there's a headshot by the Chinese athlete. Chu Zheng appeals for the headshot. Can go against Reshmi Weiging. The plainer, one of the, the referees, have got their hands up. The corner judges. So we'll just decide, there could be three points awarded to China, to Su Yin Zheng, and that will win the match for her. Of course, the video review card's been lost, there's three points awarded and that's it. Su Yin Zheng goes through and he's declared the winner of the second final. Wins on golden point, and Su Yin Zheng of China takes a second place in the final. Should be competing against Maria Espinosa. Great upset there for Reshmi Regan last year.